Hey girl, welcome to the channel, Teresa Renee. Thank you so much for stopping by. So today I want to share with you a makeup haul. I have not purchased any like foundations and it, well, it's makeup and a little bit of skincare. So I wanted to share with you what I have. I haven't purchased like any makeup and things like that in so long, but I want, I you know that now that we're back out there, girl, with that wearing makeup. And so I want to show you what I have. It's not a lot. Well, it's not a lot because I don't want to get back to the point where I, well, I ain't gonna say that because it's a nice little penny so it's a nice little bit so stay tuned and see what I got okay where should I start let's start with foundations and I recently um so i was in the in the where was i at walmart target somewhere the other day might have been target and i was just like you know what i wanted some drugstore foundations i used to purchase i really do like okay the thing is i couldn't remember my colors <laughs> so i wanted to repurchase some of them i actually have some other foundations coming from NARS, I believe it is. But I also went to pick up some in, in from the drugstore, like I said, that I used to really love. A couple of these are some I've never used before, so it's going to be new. It was new to me to pick them up. And let me start with the L'Oreal 24-Hour Infallible Pro Matte, which is what I am wearing today. And so far, I am loving it. The color I have is 11 111.5, which is nutmeg, I think. Girl, I can barely see. I'm going to tell you, my vision today is just really, really off. But I am wearing this today, and I applied it with a brush. It goes on, like, so nice. And I, I don't know how it's going to wear. I do have really oily skin, but we'll see what, you know, it's going to wear, like, by the end of the day. The next thing, I ordered these from Target, and I like how they put them in their little baggies which is nice so that if one breaks or something, it won't leak all over everything because I did order of the items. If I can get this open. So let me show you what I ordered from Target. Um, like I said, I hope these colors work for me because it's been so long since I purchased foundation. And you know, like a lot of these, you can't really read like the colors. I, I can basically read what something is and know if it's gonna work for my skin for the most part. So I got the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop 24 hour um, full coverage in cappuccino. I have used this before, absolutely love it. And I wanted to pick it up again. And I also got the Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation. Um, and this, what is this color? This color is 355 Coconut. Hope this is my color. I'm pretty sure that these are the colors that I used to use in those. These two I have used before. I love them and I want to repurchase them. Um, the next foundation I picked up is the L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Wear. Um, what is this? Sunscreen Protection SPF 25. So, I've not worn this before either. And this will be my first time wearing this. And I got this in the color. What is this color? Oh my goodness. 515. So hopefully this will fit my skin. And you know, we'll take it from there. Next up is the let me tell you. Oh, let me show you this. I did purchase the infallible 24 hour powder and this is at 365 copper i think this is too dark for me i tried it on a little bit the other day and i was like uh, it was a little bit dark so i'm not sure about it if i'm going to be able to wear this but I'm, i probably will do another um test run wear and see if i can use it. if not then i will take it back i was at somewhere and i saw this two face born this way turn up the light in deep palette and i, I decided to pick this up how cute is that right I love the packaging on this. So, oh, and this is what it looks like inside. These colors are absolutely gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Let me turn it up this way so that maybe you can see it better. But aren't they gorgeous? These are so beautiful. So we have glow, soft focus, and dazzle right here. Glow here, soft focus here, and dazzle on the back. I mean, on this side. And these are just some beautiful colors to me. Let me see, can I give you like, oh, 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 the colors are on the front. I didn't realize the colors are on the front. So, 
These are really pretty. And I decided to pick these up here. But look at that. Oh, yes. Aren't they beautiful on my skin? Oh, my goodness. I like yes. Sephora. And I picked up this. Uh, what is this? The Milk Sunshine Skin Tint Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Sunscreen. Um, I wore this, but I don't remember what it was like. So once I wear it again, I may actually let you see me apply it. But once I wear it again, I will let you see. So you click it. And once you click it, it comes down here and you just rub it on your face, which I love. I love that feature to it. But um, I'll probably do a get ready with me. Let me know if you want to see it one day and actually use this and let you know my thoughts. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, we got a lot of stuff left, girl. So, um, let's see. From, what is this? From Morphe. I was in TJ Maxx and they had this color lipstick, um, cream lipstick. I picked this one up. I tried some of theirs before. This is in the color Huffs. So let me show you what this color looks like. I love their packaging though. In their packaging, just pretty. It's black, simple, and matte. And this is what the color looks like. But let's actually swatch it so you can see it. Ooh, that's a pretty color. I like that color. Let me see it on my I love that color. Very pretty, like almost burgundy looking color. But that's really pretty. And I think I ordered something and got this MAC. What color is this? Vegas Vault. I've had Vegas Vault before. Um, and I think they gave me this free. And I have not used this before. But I said I was going to get back into using colors and bright colors and stuff. I kind of stopped and just went all nude. And I don't know. I'm just feeling using something different. So this is the Vegas Vault right there for the summer months I, I do want to use like brighter lipsticks and stuff like that just to you know jazz it up a little bit um i also picked up this rihanna fenty let me say fenty beauty by rihanna um slip shine and i've had this before this is in the color cookies and cocoa cookies and cocoa and just let me show you what this looks like very, very pretty. It is like a sheer um, lip color, but it's really pretty. It's really pretty on the lips, though. I love this stuff. It's so hydrating and moisturizing to the lips. Um, I picked up this MAC Prep and Prime Fix It Plus. Fix Plus. <laughs> I'm talking about Fix It. Fix Plus. I hadn't had one of these in a long time. I used to love it, wore it all the time, and I decided to pick it up again. And so we got that. We have, these used to be my, well, this was one of my staples. Um, this is the Laneige Eye Sleeping Mask. And I have used one of these before, absolutely loved it, um, used it up in the past. So I decided to revisit it again. And you just have this little dropper that goes in the bottle. Stick it down in there and just rub it up on the eye and it feels amazing. It really does. I decided to try the Laneige Essential Power Skin Toner um, and Lotion for combination to oily skin, which is what I actually have. And I will tell you that I have been thoroughly impressed and pleased with Laneige products. So I'm excited to try that out. Next purchase is from Minted Cosmetics. I have purchased from them before. I had wanted all of their um lip liners and so they had a sale recently like six dollars a piece or something like that and i jumped on it and bought uh, how many did i get three two four six seven because i already had one i cannot find <laughs> but i should have reordered it but it'll come up somewhere it's probably in one of my purses somewhere so um i purchased seven of these and i also got what else did i get i also picked up I had to replace my Peach for the Stars blush, and I also picked up the Yacht Life bronzer. So I'm gonna run through these um, lip liners real quick and let you see them. This is Lala. I'm actually gonna swatch them real quick for you. I don't know how quick it's gonna be, but girl, let's swatch it. Because let me tell you, for women of color, these lip liners are absolutely gorgeous. I love these lip liners. So this is Lala, which is that color right there, Lala. Layla, Lala, Layla, Lala. I think it's Lala or Layla. 
whichever way you prefer to announce to pronounce it. Next up, we have nude. And I think nude is the one that I have somewhere that I cannot find. And I may actually go back because there were more. I may actually go back and purchase more because I just think these are so women of color beautiful. This is nude. Oh, look at this nude. How pretty is that nude? Can you see it? Oh, it's nude, nude. Right there, nude. Let me bring it up. Nude is absolutely gorgeous to me. Um, next up, we have night. Night. Let me show you the packaging. This is the packaging. So night, we have, oh, that pretty brown sugar look. Isn't that gorgeous? So that's night. Next up, we have a foxy. Foxy. Oh, Foxy. That's definitely like Foxy Brown, right? There's Foxy. Oh, that is so pretty. Next up is Bear. B A R E, Bear. Let's see what Bear looks like on the skin. Oh, there's bear. There's bear right there. Bear, there, there, bear. No, is M5. So here is M5. There is M5. This one here that my finger is on. Last but not least, we have dope. D O P E. That's dope, man. Oh, really? And this is dope. Oh, and that is dope right there. So you tell me these are not color, women of color friendly. I really think anybody can wear these colors, but in particular, women of color, because oftentimes it's hard for us to find um you know, like lip liners and things like that, that are suitable to our skin tone. And I just, when the very first time I was at Ulta and tried this, I had to have it. So let me show you what Yacht Life looks like. The bronzer. And I love their matte black packaging. I just, ooh, girl, I'm distracted. I just think it's so sophisticated, but if I can get, the only thing, it is hard to get this open, like very hard to get it open, but it, it's gorgeous though. So this is a yacht life. That's what yacht life looks like. And let me see, can I do a swatch for you? Yacht life. And this is the yacht life bronzer look. Oh, that is gorgeous. Right there. Yacht life. Yeah, life. I'm, stop. I'm just saying. And I replaced this peach for the stars because mine broke. And I don't know how it broke, but it did. And I really actually liked this um, blush before when I had it. Let me see, can I open it up? And I definitely want to replace it. I had just been saying I was going to replace it. And it's one that they have that is always sold out. It's never, ever in stock. But that is, what is this? Peach for the stars. So pretty. But let me do a swatch for you. I'm going to do it on my other hand. There it is. Can you see it on my finger? Oh, yes. It's just a really nice peach um, with a little bit of shimmer. Not shimmer, but a little shine to it. But it just, like, to me, it brings life into my face. But I just love that. Can you see that? Oh, that is such a pretty color to me. And when it broke, when I broke mine, I was like, oh, no. And girl, I held on to it and it was just such of a mess that one day I just threw it away and I was so glad to actually be able to repurchase it. All right, girl. So that is my makeup haul for now. I would definitely have another one coming back. Like I said, you know, with the 
with everything changing, we're getting back out there more. Um, you know, for a couple of years, I barely wore makeup. And so I threw a lot of stuff away. And now I just needed to buy a few things to replenish my stash to, you know, just have me where I want to get made up again. So thank you so much for stopping by my channel. If you have not subscribed yet, hit the subscription button, hang out with your girl. And I will holler back at you in the next video. Bye, girl.